they're taking it to a whole other level. Yeah. Look pretty happy about it. Knoxville makes the best point. He says, uh, Steve, if you didn't have your mouth so wide open, that poo might have hit you in the face. <laughs> 15 solid. It's not 20, but 15 is good. We had an idea in the beginning that it was like the Big Brother skateboard videos with the pranks and the skating and the, the stunts and just overall bad behavior. And, but we were like, gosh, should I be behind the desk? Kind of like a cross between that and The Daily Show. And Jeff said, let's call Spike, because he and Spike went to uh, high school together. I think it was Spike who said, why are you even worried about the format of the show? Just do what you're doing in the Big Brother videos. You know, my phone rings when I'm in like ninth grade or something, and uh, they're like, yeah, it's Jeff Tremaine and Johnny Knoxville, Spike Jones from, uh, we want to do this MTV show called Jackass. I said, are you even allowed to say that? And they said, well, it was going to be asshole. But they couldn't do that. They had to do jackets. Our first pitch was to HBO, uh, these uh, two ladies at HBO, who were not ready for this. It was the most awkward meeting I've still ever sat through. Uh, we showed the tape, and then it was just crickets. But our next meeting was MTV, who loved it. We didn't expect it was going to get on television. And actually, during the pilot, we were making the pilot for uh, MTV and we got shut down like three days in they're like we thought we were done then none of us knew what the fuck we were doing we didn't get permits we, it was very spontaneous it was very illegal <laughs> everything we shot you can't plan too much when you're doing spontaneous things otherwise it's not spontaneous so we start with a shell of an idea and then kind of toss it in the air and uh, see what happens we would just get our cameras with film, <laughs> film and batteries, tapes, and go wherever we did stuff and just film as much as we can and put something together. <laughs> Mouth wide open. I was always scared, I don't know. I yeah, was always scared. <laughs> they were, I mean, we were afraid for what they were gonna do to us. So believe it or not, it was the idea that they were around. Like, you know, if you heard one noise in the night, you were like, huh, you know? And so you were always just, huh, huh, where are they? Always trying to keep tabs on where they were. first movie, everyone was so surprised that it was a hit. The second movie, that was our naughtiest one. It was really dirty. And I think we were probably all on our worst behavior during that time period. That one has a special place. And the third one, I think, was the most complete overall. Everyone's a little, uh, you know, a little off in their own way. On the first movie that we had a lot of bad reviews, and then on the second and third movie, it became hip for the critics to like our movies. And all of a sudden, the same people that were just telling us it was the worst thing in the history of Hollywood were like, this is art. This is a documentary about life. Have fun. <laughs> it's so funny every time. I've had 24 surgeries now, and you can't really fake that stuff. And I think that's one of the reasons people really were drawn to the show is, is, is that they could watch people destroy themselves without actually having to do it themselves. Watching all this stuff makes me want to just make another movie, though. That's what I want to do, too. I'm just, yeah, well, I rarely watch any of our old stuff because they get me all and I have nothing to do. I'm just spinning my wheels with nowhere to go. Or we're older, but I don't care. Like, I don't, I don't feel like acting my age. I don't care either. Other people have tried to to emulate what we've done with Jackass, but it's the characters and our friendship that I think people really respond to. And, you know, we're here 15 years later and people are still coming up to me and Preston and everybody else and like giving us high fives and saying, I love your work, man. 
you know? And that's a yeah, lot. Yeah, I'll money. keep asking for more. What's up, I'm Bam Margera, and it's the Jackass 15 year anniversary.